What's up everyone? Trying a new format for this video, a short sound bite. So let me know what you think. As much as 50% of knowledge is lost in every handoff, that means by the time work has hit four handoffs, the recipient potentially only gets 6% of the knowledge associated with the work. You need to move with the work as a multidisciplinary team and minimize handoffs. Let's look at this in the context of a race. The air is thick with competition. As one sprinter approaches the next, they prepare for the perfect handoff. The waiting runner is tense with anticipation, and then it happens. Boom, quick as lightning, the baton is passed and the next leg begins. All too often the transition between product strategy and product management, or any two areas involved with a product for that matter, happens like the perfect Olympic relay race. Just as one runner hands off to the next, one function hands off to the next. But what would happen if the runner continued just a bit to encourage their fellow sprinter? Instead of thinking of it as a clean handoff, think of it as an overlapping transition. One team continues to assist the next. For example, the product strategist continues to provide guidance, coaching, and support until the product team is ready to run. The perfect handoff is really a recipe for failure in the transition between product strategy and product management, design and product management, or product management and engineering. Don't plan to reach the end of your leg. Plan to run past it for a while. Here are a few ways you can transition with success. Plan for parallel efforts. As you build your plan, add time to overlap with the next team in the chain to run alongside and support them. Ask the team taking the baton what they need to be successful. Instead of assuming the parallel efforts required, take the time to understand what would work best. And finally, run farther than needed. Stay on longer than requested to make the transition. That extra time, coaching, and encouragement could mean the difference between success and failure. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit like and subscribe if you'd like to see more. Thanks everyone.